This is a story about the king and the seed. A king in the Far East was growing old and knew it was time to choose his successor. Instead of choosing one of his assistants or his children, he decided something different. He called young people in the kingdom together one day. He said, It is time for me to step down and choose the next king. I have decided to choose one of you. The kids were shocked. But the king continued. I am going to give each one of you a seed today. One very special seed. I want you to plant the seed, water it, and come back here one year from today with what you have grown from this one seed. I will then judge the plants that you bring, and the one I choose will be the next king. The kids were confused. All the young boys returned to their home. One boy named Yusuf was there the day, and he, like the others, received a seed. He went home and excitedly told his mother the story. His mother was very happy hearing it. She helped him get a pot and planting soil, and he planted the seed and watered it carefully. Every day, he would water it and watch to see if it had grown. Days passed by. Nothing appeared from the pot. Yusuf kept checking his seed, but nothing ever grew. Three weeks. Four weeks. Five weeks. Went by. Still nothing. By now, others were talking about their plants. They were happy. Everyone else had trees and tall plants, but he had nothing. Yusuf didn't say anything to his friends, however. He just kept waiting for a seed to grow. A year finally went by. The young men were called to the kingdom with their plants. Yusuf told his mother that he wasn't going to take an empty pot. Mom advised Yusuf to be honest in what happened. Yusuf felt sick to his stomach, but he knew his mother was right. The young men brought their plants to the king for inspection. Plants grown by the other youths were beautiful in all shapes and sizes. Yusuf took his empty pot to the palace. The king arrived. He surveyed the room and greeted the young people. My, what great plants, trees and flowers you have grown. Today, one of you will be appointed the next king, said the king. All of a sudden, the king spotted Yusuf with his empty pot. He ordered his guards to bring him to the front. Yusuf was terrified. When Yusuf got to the front, the has asked his name. My name is Yusuf. All the kids were laughing and making fun of him. He looked at Yusuf and then announced to the crowd. Behold your new king. His name is Yusuf. Yusuf couldn't believe it. Yusuf couldn't even grow his seed. How could he be the new king? Then the king said, One year ago today, I gave everyone here a seed. I told you to take the seed, plant it, water it, and bring it back to me today. But I gave you all boiled seeds which would not grow. All of you, except Yusuf, have brought me trees and plants and flowers. When you found that the seed would not grow, you substituted another seed for the one I gave you. Yusuf was the only one 
with the courage and honesty, to bring me a pot with my seed in it, therefore, he is the one, who will be the new king.